after a while, catching up on the phone just doesn't do the trick. We've just missed each other so much and we just um, just want to be a little closer. Evelyn lives in Washington State and her sister is here in BC. So they decided to meet up at the border like so many others have throughout the pandemic. But they were surprised to see this new fence. I asked if it was electric. <laughs> so it's not. This stretch of the border along Zero Avenue in Abbotsford has always been separated by just a ditch, no walls or barriers. But this week, the Americans began putting up this fence on their side. And today, more drilling. I call it the Trump wall. Maybe it's because of the uh, COVID-19 people meet during the day, uh, mostly on the weekend. And they, uh, they sit on each side of their country and they, they stay there for hours. When we asked the Border Patrol agent why... It helps reduce the illegal crossing of people and products. In a statement, the U.S. Border Patrol said the cable barrier is to protect both countries, to secure the border by deterring illegal cars from entering either side, saying transnational criminal organizations have capitalized on this vulnerable area by smuggling both narcotics and people. Just last month, police caught two men running the border, and the RCMP seized over 200 kilograms of meth, likely one of the largest in Canadian history. I don't know who the Americans are trying to keep out because the vast majority of Canadians have no interest in traveling to this country. My concern about putting up this fence is it's similar to the Berlin Wall. When the Berlin Wall first went up, it wasn't a big, a big wall, it was a small fence. And it's a slippery slope. Where does it stop? Are they now going to put up more of a permanent wall? Oh, it is kind of nice to feel like we're in the same proximity. I feel like a border or having a fence between the border would kind of make it less personal. While yeah, families and friends like continue to be separated state by state the border shutdowns, having a physical barrier just makes it feel more real. Tina Lovegreen, CBC News, Abbotsford.